Ladies, car makers are starting to leave old time radios out of their newer models, and lawmakers are not happy about it. Ford, Volkswagen, BMW, and Tesla are among the many manufacturers phasing out the AM and FM frequencies. This is reportedly because of the medium's shrinking audience and the fact that electric engines tend to interfere with AM. However, a bipartisan bill from Congress is pushing back, arguing that AM radio in particular is an integral part of the federal government's ability to deliver public safety information. In other words, don't touch that dial. In other news, we've been told not to use plastic water bottles that contain the chemical compound bisphenol A, or BPA as it's commonly known. But it turns out there's a lot of BPA in our clothing. Tests by the Watchdog Group, the Center for Environmental Health, found multiple companies sold athletic wear that could expose wearers to as much as 40 times the safe limit of BPA. And not just cheap knockoff brands either. This list includes Adidas, Nike, Patagonia, Athleta, Champion, and more. Given that exposure to BPA has been linked to heart disease, asthma, and erectile dysfunction, I recommend exercising naked. Speaking of Adidas, it's also having to deal with all its leftover Yeezy stock. The company's breakup with Kanye West in October left it with a reported $1.3 billion worth of unsold product. And now reports are that Adidas will be selling off its remaining inventory. But rather than pocketing the money, they'll be donating a significant amount of the proceeds to select organizations that work to combat discrimination and hate. Kanye will also be getting a cut, which I'm sure he'll be happy about. Don't go away.